One group that benefited from the extinction of the dinosaurs were the mammals. With the dinosaurs out of the picture, new species of mammals ventured forth, foraging and reproducing at will. Each of life's new variations competed in a changing, challenging world. A world of fierce predators, scarce resources, and climate shifts. At every stage, there were winners and losers. The winners adapted and survived. The losers disappeared. Then, some 40 million years ago, a new order of mammals evolved with whom humans share a common ancestry, the primates. Some species of primates thrive to this day. But tens of millions of years ago, many others vied for selection. According to science, we are descended from such creatures. By a million years ago, our ancestors were doing things no animal had done before. They wore clothes and used fire. They began to fashion stones and bones into elaborate tools and weapons. By about 40,000 years ago, not content with simply surviving, these early humans painted pictures of the things they saw on the walls of caves. They made sculptures and developed the capacity for language. A crucial milestone had been reached. For the first time, creatures wondered about their place in the world. Here was an animal who contemplated things, abstract things, distant things, one who remembered the past and anticipated the future. During the past 10,000 years, a blink in the history of the cosmos, this species has changed almost everything. With the advent of writing, they found new ways to store information, to educate, and to share knowledge. The effects were dramatic. Writing greatly amplified what a single brain could do and enabled the rise of complex societies. Within no time, great thinkers were using writing to communicate the workings of the universe. But this species wouldn't simply think about the world, it would use its intelligence to reshape it. Unlike other animals who were limited by their own muscle power, humankind began to unlock nature's energy sources, first for heating and cooking, and later to provide power for their machines and other technologies. Over the past few thousand years, humankind has used this energy to transform the materials found in nature, turning them into products of every imaginable kind. Humans have learned to grow so much food that no one need go hungry. We have learned to defeat many diseases and extend human lifespans. But not every human invention has been positive. 
Humankind has applied its ingenuity to build weapons of destruction, which have fueled our aggressive instincts. The nuclear weapons of the 20th century came close to sending us the way of the dinosaurs. Into oblivion. How will the story of the Earth unfold? Perhaps more than anything else, humankind is curious. We are explorers. The same species that once traveled on foot has now found ways to explore the entire globe. stone of the millennium, humans actually left the planet and looked back at Earth from another celestial body. Perhaps it is our destiny to keep exploring, for our curiosity to triumph. Perhaps one day, Humans will travel far beyond our home in space to colonize other worlds, spreading life and culture throughout the cosmos. Whatever lies in our future, there's no denying that things have come a very long way since the Big Bang. As the pace of change accelerates over the next thousand years, we naturally wonder where will humanity go from here? <laughs>